up YouTube? It's your girl Angie. For those who don't know me, I am Angie and I'm back with another YouTube video. You Take time for me, don't run away. Cause baby, we got unfinished business set. So for today's video, it's gonna be like a maintenance. Uh, yeah, a maintenance vlog because I was about to say get ready with me, but what am I getting ready for? You know what I'm saying? So this is going to be a maintenance vlog. I cannot speak. First, I already got ready. So I'm going to go ahead and show you my entire fit. So like I was saying, my jacket is from Shein. This dress is from Forever 21. I got it like four years ago and I was so tiny, skinny and petite four years ago. Don't get me wrong, I'm still tiny, but I gained weight so the dress fits me better. Like, it's more fitted, if that makes sense. And the sandals I'm wearing are also from Forever 21. These are like my go-to sandals. I bought two pairs from Forever 21, a black pair, and these white pairs that are like crisscross. And they're super comfy. They were like two for $20, so I was like, Yes, we love sales. You gotta be bad. He's on a budget. Today, I'm going to get my nails done and my toes done. Because my toes are looking a little rough. I'm gonna go ahead and show y'all my toes. Please do not laugh at me. Don't laugh. These are how my toes are looking like right now, which is terrible. And my fingers, my nails are looking like this. They grew, which I love. So I'm gonna go ahead and get a mani pedi. I'm getting a manicure and a pedicure. I think I'm gonna do regular on my fingernails and then gel on my toes only because I wash the dishes a lot and stuff. So, and I'm always picking on my nails. So I feel like there's no point in me getting gel because I'm just gonna be like, you know what I'm saying? So it does not make sense. But yeah, I'm gonna get my nails done. I'm not gonna get my lashes done in this video because I'm trying to let my lashes breathe. I am using this serum. I'm gonna go ahead and grab the serum so I can show you guys. I'm not sponsored by the brand of this lash serum, so I'm just gonna put y'all on game. This is a lash serum right here. It's called Sugar Bear Lash Care Vegan Vitamin Serum. It's by Sugar Bear, that's the company name. They have more stuff. I had the opportunity to choose one thing off their website for free to try it out like as a trial. I'm in love. I put this on every single morning. It's clear. It comes with like an applicator. I don't know if y'all can see that. Yeah. It's not like a spoolie. It's just an applicator. You just swipe and swipe on your lashes, on the top of your lashes, and magic. Like, I'm going to show y'all my lashes now. I don't have a before and an after, but my lashes used to be short because I used to get lash extensions and I used to use lash, lash strips. I used to just like literally like take them off but now i've learned that i need to actually remove my lashes professionally so yeah but this i don't know if y'all can tell but y'all can see this side my lashes are pretty long and then the same thing with that side my lashes are super long after i get my nails done i'm gonna go ahead and go to the beauty supply store because I did do this yesterday and it looked good yesterday. Maybe I need to start using gel and stuff. But I'm also trying new things. If y'all don't know, now y'all know, I'm gonna start doing hair. My Instagram is gonna be right there. It's called Made by Yvette. Yvette is my middle name, just in case y'all get confused. Don't forget to follow my regular Instagram too. I, I am Angelique because we're on the road to 70K and then my hair page we're almost at a thousand followers so get me to 1k followers i think we're at 952 so far i've been doing like braided ponytails high braided ponytails or low braided ponytails i'm trying to get into the barbie pony the bubble pony crisscross pony i'm gonna be taking appointments very soon but for now i'm doing just model appointments so i can have something to like post on my instagram if that makes sense because your girl need to look like she's getting content and getting clients. So yeah, we're gonna go ahead and go to the beauty supply store so I can grab just like tracks so I can do a traditional ponytail. Before I do it on any client, I practice on myself. That's one thing I do do. I've already done the high and I've done the low ponytail, which really cute. And I always do dramatic edges if y'all can see. 
always i don't know if y'all would consider this dramatic but i consider this dramatic because um some of it it's my baby hairs and some of it is just hair i took out from you know my regular hair so we had to stop to get some food and this is actually our first time at this restaurant so we're gonna see if it's good So let me tell you all this, right? I got my nails done, got my toes done, but let me actually before I tell y'all, I'm just gonna show y'all my nails and my toes because they actually came out cute. So I'm not gonna talk shit about that, but let me just show y'all. So here are my here are my toes and then my nails pink I match. Like I was saying, okay, listen. So when I walked in there, I was like, let me get a mani pedi. Well, I was like, can I please, ha can I please get a mani pedi? You know, um, they're from Vietnam. Viet they're Vietnamese, so their accent is very different from an English accent. Obviously, everybody knows that when they walk to Nelson Rock. But they understood me like very good. I was like, can I get a mani pedi? And then I asked them for the price, because you know, some places they'd be like. $35 or some places be like oh, okay 40 some places be like 50 this place was $49 for a mani pedi regular so I was like okay regular that means if it's gel it should be like 60 70 right so um I was like okay can I get gel and they were like okay it's gonna be $20 extra on top of the 49 so I was like okay and they were like okay so 69 I was like okay cool like that's fine so um I went to the chair got my my pedicure, whatever, this, that, and the third. And then the dude started polishing my nails. And then um, I was getting distracted because I was on Instagram. So I didn't realize that um, he had already put the clear coat. So he said, oh, you're all done. And I was just like, I'm all done. I asked for gel. And he was like, oh, she said regular. I was like, no, I said gel. Like I literally told her gel. And he was like, oh, it's okay, I'll take it off and I'll redo it. I was like, no, it's already there. I'm not going to make you take off the gel polish and the color polish. Then put the color polish and the gel polish back and gel uh, and like cure it with the gel, the gel lead light thing. And he was like, no, it's okay, it's okay. I'll do it. I was like, no, it's fine. Like, it's already there. Like, there's no point and I don't got time for this. Like, I got to go. I got other things to do. But... And it's only 3.34, y'all, so, I mean, I, I lied to them. I don't really got much things to do today, but I, 
I was just trying to get out of there, honestly. And then um, they were like, okay, um, so since you were in jail, you want your manicure to be jail? I was like, no, it's okay. Like, just do it regular because then I wouldn't get the deal for the, the Manny Petty for forty nine dollars. Cause they were gonna, they were gonna charge me twenty dollars additional to this, and I was like, a manicure is not fifty dollars. Like, I've been to nail salons and a manicure is not fifty dollars. A manicure, your natural nails, the most for gel is like twenty twenty eight thirty dollars. And they were like, oh, it's going to be 40 something for your, um, 49 for your, for your nails. And then if you do a gel, pedicure is going to be 69. And I was like, uh, never mind. It's cool. Because that's like a hundred and something. I could get acrylic nails and a freaking a full set of acrylic toes. Like, no, I'm not doing that. So I was like, you know, I'm not coming back to this nail salon again. Maybe I'm bugging. Call me cheap if you want to. But I don't think I'm being cheap. I think I'm being reasonable. Because... I've been to regular nail salons and then I've been to like actual like nail techs when they do nails, manicures, and pedicures. So I know I'm not tweaking, but my nails are cute. They're still drying. That's why I'm like talking like this. I had to come home to let my nails dry, my toes dry, because I'm not going to drive and pick up my phone, pick up my purse, and go to the beauty supply store to pick up hair when my nails are not even dry yet. So I'm going to let them dry and then probably like in 30 minutes, they should be dry. So it's 3.36 right now. I'll probably head out at like 4, 4, 10. So I go to the beauty supply store and then I'm going to do this hair because it's coming off. I know y'all see that. Look at this. This is still intact. I did that. I did really good. But the top part, I feel like I need to edge up or do it a little bit tighter. And I also gotta buy Gots to Be spray because I'm running out. All of my hair products are literally like right there, y'all. It's 8.07. I don't want you to see my mess too, but it's 8.07. Back from the hair store like a couple hours ago, but then we had to leave again to run some errands, and then we just got food. I we got little scissors. I'm gonna show y'all what I got from the hair store. I spent pick a thirty and ninety eight dollars and ninety one cents. I don't know if y'all can see the price. Just know it's ninety eight dollars and ninety one cents. I'm practicing on myself before I practice on clients. I don't know if I said that already. So I got, okay, I'm doing somebody's hair. Their color is 1B, so I got them. Their hair color. I got two of those, just in case. Extra, the more the merrier. I also got some bundles. So I got two 1Bs and then two fours. The fours are for me, because my color is number four. And then the 1B is for Whoever's hair I decided to do and I won't ask them to bring hair because I'm practicing. So there's that and I got straight bundles. Um I tried to find body wave or at least like curly bundles, but the hair store that I went to didn't have any, so that's that. And then in here there's just products, so I ran out of got to be so I grabbed me a big one. I already had hair glue, but well, this is bonding glue. I already had hair bond glue, but I had one that was this small, and I know I'm gonna need more, so this is gonna come in handy. I got three edge brushes, two smaller ones, I don't know if y'all see that, and then a bigger one for ponytails, and then it's for edges. These, I've heard wooden ones are better than like the plastic ones, so hopefully that's true, and I'm gonna definitely start using these. Lastly, I got scissors just in case I need to cut any excess off of the braids. Got that. And then I also got some oil, some tea tree oil, which will also come in handy. This is mostly for Isil's hair because his hair, his scalp is dry. So he's definitely in need of this. But I'm also 
use this on my clients. I'm gonna get some more oil, but you know, as we start, we gotta start off small with not too much stuff. You don't wanna go crazy buying a bunch of stuff and it's just like, you're not getting nowhere, you know? Hungry as hell. So? I gotta eat. I forgot to pick up the camera so I could like show y'all the process. I made a TikTok, so I'll probably insert the TikTok of the entire process. I'm not sure. I'm actually not feeling this at all. I don't know if I did it correctly or if I did it incorrectly. It looks like I did it right. I just don't like the feel of my ponytails right there is that how like it's supposed to be or am i tripping so see and i can like i can hear it so it's just like if anybody comes close to me back up and don't touch my ponytail bitch because i don't need anything falling out and i feel like y'all can see the ponytail i feel like i need a, i should have added two bundles instead of one if i'm not mistaken I might just walk around with this hoe for a little bit, but I definitely do gotta do my edges. And yes, I cut my edges. Well, my hair. I have edges. Don't think I don't have edges. I do have edges. So this is how my hair looks. This is how my hair looks right here. I did my edges, very dramatic. The hair is giving, very much giving. I think this is 24 inch too. So, yes. I'm actually in love. This is everything I used, y'all. I know there's a mess, like look at this mess. That's my old pony that I had. And this the new one. Say hello to this one. Very much giving. And I love it. And this is how my hair is looking like. I know y'all see the edges. And this is how the back is looking like. I fixed the part that was messed up, which was like up here. I just added a bobby pin. 
and it actually looks like there's no bobby pin so i did that and it's 209 p.m i started this at 12 30 and i like finished at two like i'm done doing my hair that's really the end of this video like i just needed to get my hair done my nails done and my toes done and Bae just went to chipotle he's gonna go get me some food Okay. this is the end of the video i hope you guys enjoyed this video as much as i did because i actually enjoyed filming and being in this video follow all my socials i'm gonna i made it real easy for y'all it's at i am angeli and don't forget follow my hair page because we're almost at 1k this is not subscribers my bad we're almost at 1k followers it's at laid by event i'm gonna add it in this video so don't forget to go follow if you guys live in orlando in the orlando kissimmee area Please book with your girl, cause your, your girl got it. Your girl, your girl know what she doing. Your girl got it. She know what she doing. I love you guys. See you in the next video.